All right, let's go. Uh, I decided to film one thing today and I ended up filming three things because I found this at a random 7-Eleven. It's the new, you see it up there, new flavor of Doritos, sweet and tangy barbecue. Cue the intro. What is up everyone? It is the endorsement and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive. So I was out um, getting gas and then I was looking for pitch black. Uh, pitch black is coming back out. The Mountain Dew flavor pitch black. Uh, I don't know the exact date, uh, but since I had to get gas, I was looking in a uh, 7-Eleven and uh, they didn't have the pitch black, but they did have the new Doritos sweet and tangy barbecue or bbq however you want to say it but it's a new flavor says it right there is it going to be limited edition is it going to stay around for a while you never know but probably uh limited edition let's just get right into it now uh for all you dorito uh aficionados out there have they ever come out with a uh, barbecue flavor i think i remember one whoa trying to think and then I got hit got hit up all in the face noggin with the smell of sweet and tangy barbecue so let me get you into the bag right there do you see it 2023 you're inside the bag of Doritos check it out right there I'm glad they uh you know filled this to the top We all have our theories on why they don't fill it to the top. All right, there you go. Let's get you up close to uh, one of these uh, sweet and tangy barbecue Doritos. I smell the barbecue. I also smell the corn. So that's gonna be the main difference. You're gonna have a barbecue uh, Dorito that's going to be corn flavored instead of potato flavored if you are someone who enjoys uh, barbecue chips. Let's go, brand new flavor, here we go. subtle it's there but subtle this guy I'm gonna park right next to you he said every spot except two available in this parking lot that guy I'm gonna park next to you huh oh, he's getting out he's getting out Where you going, buddy? That guy. That guy. I respect the fashion game, but he is uh, rocking different color everything. He's got the one color shirt, another color pants, another color uh, socks, and bright red sneakers. Uh, I respect the game, but in a way, they don't go together. They don't go together. I'm just saying. I'm not a fashionista, but I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Um, hmm. are they BBQ? Yes. Are they sweet? Yes. Do they have a tang? Sure. Uh, I guess they're delivering on everything uh, they are promoting. Again, one more time, sweet and tangy barbecue. I don't know. I like barbecue chips, but I think I prefer barbecue with uh, potato chips a little bit more than corn chips. Uh, I'm pretty sure they have the uh, barbecue Fritos as well. Uh, but this one, take a look one more time. Yeah, look at that. I'm showing you a Dorito up close. Look at that. I don't know, like I said, I was gonna film one video, I filmed two, and then I found these, so I'm filming three. I actually have another hat in the uh, car. I was gonna change the hat, a little wardrobe change, but I'm like, no, no. The essential thing here is to try these, let you know if I like them, and probably stop talking, because a lot of you out there are ready to type. If you haven't already, he takes the first bite app. He gives the review app. Video starts app. Listen. Listen, I enjoy having my own channel. I enjoy talking to you guys. I enjoy where my brain goes in these videos. Uh, like I said, it's never scripted. And uh, we're just having some fun reviewing a new 
flavor of Doritos. One more bite, we'll give it a rating. Like it, don't love it. I say it many times on the channel, many times. All right, so listen, um, on a scale of one to 100, with one meaning don't even waste your money, and 100 being the promised land of... I'm going to give the sweet and tangy BBQ Doritos brand new flavor that I found at 7-Eleven a rating of... Whew, kind of torn. I like them. Um, I think the flavor could be a little more intense, but um, I'm going to give them an 80. I'm going to give them an 80. That's an 8.0. That's an 8.0, uh, especially if you're keeping score in your endorsement notebooks, logging it in right there. That's a round number. I almost gave it an 81, and I also gave it a 79. But at the last minute, I didn't. I did it. I gave it an 80 and I'm sticking to it. So uh, there you go. Another review in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media, getting the word on my channel out to the masses. In closing, have you seen Pitch Black, the uh, returning Mountain Dew flavor? Have you seen this uh, Doritos flavor? I haven't seen anything pop up in my recommended as of filming uh, where someone has found those uh, Doritos and reviewed it. Uh, but again, I don't watch many uh, review channels, uh, but uh, normally they pop up in the feed for the ones that I follow. I have not seen those. Uh, so light up the comments, let me know. Pitch Black, uh, when I find it, I will review it. And these are uh, already reviewed because you just watched it. All right, you're not going to get a fourth video. I mean, you're going to get another video after this, but I'm not filming a fourth video today. I started at 10.15 or 10.17, 10.20. I know it. I started at 10.20 a.m. this morning, and it's something like 2.15. I'm done for the day. I got to edit. I got a video dropping today, Pringles. Uh, I've talked enough. We'll see you soon with some more reviews. Bye.